<laughs> What's going on, my space? All right, you know today's part ten, and I got a lot of shit to get off my chest. Let's start from one. Okay, didn't I make a a video called "Put Words in People's Mouth"? Yeah, obviously that's still happening, and I don't like the shit. So I'm gonna, you know, go ahead and clear my name right now. Anything that I gotta say, I'll say it to y'all. All right. Point blank and simple. Okay, next subject. All right. Uh, there's some people that's been hating, hating on my wife. I know she ain't my wife, though. You know what I'm saying? Lil' Kim. Talking about she whacking everything. And I heard a few people say this. But you know what? She's got a little message for y'all. So here it is. This next joint is for them hating ass bitches and niggas. Yeah, Kim. Who thought I was going to rot in jail. This is what I've been waiting for. Who thought I couldn't do it again. That's the left hook. The right motherfucking hook. Yeah, well, the motherfucking queen is back, bitch. Go hide under the motherfucking rock. Fuck you. <laughs> you see that? See what she just said? That's what she said. <laughs> anyway, I want to go ahead and um, point out a couple of people that I don't like at this point. Okay, uh, Ross, I know you're watching this. And motherfucker, I'm going to tell you this right now. You fake as fuck. I know you're watching, and I hope you are. You're fake as hell. That's the reason why your ass has been eliminated, okay? Your shot of friendship is over, all right? <laughs> Give me my motherfucking key. Motherfucker, damn. I mean, what the fuck? Another person. Tez. Tez. You too, nigga. You too. You know what you did. And you fucking, I'm salty at you for that because, you know, I thought we was cool and everything. But it's alright, though. You know what? Because I'm about to let the cat out the bag, see? Um, one day, I'm going to put your business out. <laughs> one day, remember that time that uh, you and your cousin, you and your so-called cousin supposedly went upstairs, didn't come out hours and hours and hours? What was y'all doing? What was y'all doing? Well, that's not your cousin from what I found out. That's your boyfriend. Yeah, you didn't want nobody to know that was your boyfriend. You didn't know, you didn't want nobody to know that you was upstairs getting your wang on. I'm like, I'm not stupid, alright? You try to say to everybody that's your cousin. Bitch, get you the fuck out of here. Stop it, you know alright? Just stop. Just fucking stop. You a thug and everything and whatnot, but you know what? Round. Cat's out the bag. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen. The hell is on my damn... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is part 10, and this is what I'm getting ready to talk to you about right now. It's a lot of fake shit that's been going on, and you know, I am very, very sick and tired of it. This is the reason why I make these videos. It's called Shade TV, because anything that gets thrown towards me in a bad vibe or anything, yeah, I throw shade. It's like Dragon Ball Z, you know, how many, how many y'all, like, you know, so, or some other shit like that. But... I tell you right now, everybody that is watching this, I love y'all. For real. I love y'all. I love y'all to death. And I'm going to go ahead and do my shout outs at the end of the video. One thing I'm going to tell people not to do, quit hating. Please, just quit hating. Ain't nobody hating on me, but just quit hating, period. Because I get, I get sick and tired of hearing people talking about, well, they can't do this. Well, they can't do that. Why the hell? Are you sitting there worried about what somebody else is doing? Why are you worried about somebody else's business? It's just like my business. Whatever's my business, I'm not going to sit there and tell the entire world, like, yeah, you know, one day I went to the market and, yeah, I robbed, you know, I robbed them for some bananas or anything else <laughs> like that. You know, just I'm, I'll tell you like this, stay out of people's business. Just stop. Close friends, if you got somebody that's about to tell you something about them or anything, just be like, I ain't got nothing to do with it. I ain't got nothing to do with it, because I'm not trying to get dragged in no shit. That's how shit gets, you know, all stirred up. Shit, drama gets stirred up like that, because people are running their fucking mouth, worrying about whoever else is business, who's sleeping with who, who's kissing who. Stay out of their fucking business. If they getting some cutty, if they getting some wang, so what? I don't give a fuck, because sure as hell, it's not me. It's not me that's fucking them, so I don't give a fuck. I don't understand why people run to me like, oh, well, I'm sleeping with such and such a person. So? So? As long as you ain't sleeping with too many of them, you're fine. But if it's only one, let me get it again. One? It's, no, it's nothing. It's nothing. So I want to tell Springfield Township right now, Green Hills, Forest Park, 
wherever the hell y'all at, I am not the one to fuck with when it comes to drama. Because you know karma is a bitch. And I love karma. I'll marry the bitch if I have to. Because <laughs> I hate the fact that close friends are stabbing each other in the back for little shit. And I can't, I can't, I can't stand that. That makes me want to just have a goldfish and a puppy. You know what I'm saying? Maybe a goat from my best friend. I don't care. I really don't. It's done and over with. You all have to have fucking common sense, alright? Y'all have to have common sense when it comes to stupid shit. Little stupid shit can blow something real, real big. You're like a nuclear bomb. You know what I'm saying? Just blow it all up. And then friendships get ended like that. And you know, and for the people that's around here, I understand the shit that's been going on. I understand all this he say, she say bullshit, all that yada yada, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? Just drop it, alright? Drop the shit because it's not worth losing a friendship and losing a life. Because, you know, people are crazy as hell these days over this, over stupid shit. Oh, you stole my goldfish crackers, you fake. That ain't me, y'all, so shut up. <laughs> that ain't me. I do call people fake for a reason because they actually are. I hate from when people try to say that I said something that I know I didn't say. It didn't come out of my damn mouth. You know, whatever. I want to actually get on this subject because this has been bothering me. Okay, y'all y'all know the, the video of how girls gone wild, right? Okay, I never heard, <laughs> I never heard a video called uh, Minors Gone Wild. And if y'all don't know what that is, it's pretty much somebody that's the age of over 18 that want to have little 14, 15 year old girls in a wet t-shirt contest. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that shit is wrong. That's wrong. I don't give a damn how horny you feel you are. I don't give a damn if your hormones are hitting the sky roof. What is that going to do for anybody? Prizes? Bitch, you broke. What the fuck? Prizes? What, you, what the fuck you going to get? A throbbing member? No. No. Them days are over with. Tiny member, okay? Tiny member. Y'all know what I'm talking <laughs> Do I have to put it on the screen? Y'all, nah, no I don't. <laughs> no I don't, but I'm going to do it anyway. Bink, bink, bink. <laughs> y'all, you know what? Part 11 is getting ready to come up, and I actually have to make Part 11 something big. I got to make it something big. So, ooh, they're fighting. I'm watching Jerry Springer. <laughs> it's actually like 412, yeah. But, um, I might have to make it real big, you know what I'm saying? I've got to... Seriously, just, I got to duke it all out. And the more drama that happens around here, the more it's going to be on TV. So next time, y'all have to remember, stay close to your friends. If you can't do that, just stay away from them. If it just comes down to two people, you and another person, that's all you need. You don't need a big group of friends to keep your life together. Come on now, come on now. I don't, but you know, I just choose to. But I can easily cut somebody off real quick. So then, till then, y'all, part 11 is getting ready to come up, and I will see y'all later. And y'all have to comment on this. Y'all have to. Ask questions. Do whatever. Matter of fact, if y'all got any questions, hit me up at my number. Yeah, there it is. There it go. Yeah, it's up there. So, I ain't got no minutes right now, but when I do, you know what I'm saying, y'all can go ahead and hit us. You know, and hit up the brother, you know what I'm saying, and tell me how you feel about the situation. I should make a, a hotline or something. But until then, y'all, I'll see y'all later. Until then, be safe. Holla. I'm a bitch with a fat puss and a nigga with a fat dick. In the Mickey, you're Mallory Moe. Rolling through the streets of 24 zone. Crunk, screaming, die, bitch. About to shut your shit down. Anybody that opposes the pain, that's a feed false. If the straps don't bleed, y'all.